Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trust Stanley at TS Tech Talks video. In today's video guys, I'm going to teach you how to back up your Signal application chat online. So if you are chatting on Signal application and probably have some conversation images and every other thing you did on your Signal app and you want to back it up online, I'm going to show you guys how to do just that. On default, Signal actually allows you to back up your apps or your chats or on your device, but I'm going to show you guys how to back it up online. Let's dive into that. So um, for today's video, I'm going to be making use of different applications. And if you have a file um, explorer, do not download, but if not, go ahead and download either this file explorer or you download file manager. And then the next application you are going to be making use of is actually either you make use of Google Drive or you make use of Dropbox. I already have Dropbox installed on my device, so I'm not going to make use of that. So um, another application we are going to need for this video is your Google Keep. It's called Keep. So I'm going to be making use of this particular application, which is my best choice for this video, because um, the reason why I'm making use of this app is because it actually synchronizes online. So um, if you have your Google app, if you have your Google email um, logged in, it's going to synchronize every content that you are putting on the Keep online for you. So the next time you download your app and install Google Keep, it automatically restores every information for you. So now let's dive into the Google Signal backing up of your chats. So go ahead and open your Google um, your Signal application, the Google Signal. Open your Signal application, and then open. Um, go ahead and tab in the tab the three dotted icon right here and click on the settings option now you can locate where it says charts right click on the chart section now notice where it says backup right click on the backup section now um you notice where it says um turn on go ahead and tap the turn on to turn on the chart so um you notice this um it says uh backup will be saved to your external device um, with encrypted phrase pass phrase below you must have um, you must have this pass phrase in order to restore your backup which means this pass phrase is as important as your backup if not they are not going to be um, they're not going to be relevant so all you need to do is to tap this pass phrase once you tap on the pass phrase automatically it copies to your clipboard now you can go ahead and open the google keep or whichever test tool that you downloaded for me i'm making use of google keep so once you open your google keep click on this plus icon to type in um to save in a new um document so for my case i'm going to tap um for the title of the keep i'm going to tap signal backup pass because it's actually a pass freeze so type in pass freeze and then click on the notes section click and hold to give you an option to paste what you already copied um it's talking okay now is display paste it so this is exactly what I copied. Um, for some reason, you can change the color to a unique color so that you easily identify it. That is, if you have a lot of, if you have a lot of notes on your sticky on your um, Google Keep. So now go ahead and come back to the Signal application. Tap on the um, I have written down the passphrase and then click on enable passphrase. Now, if you click on enable, the next thing it displays for you is to create the backup. Now, um, to create the backup, all you need to do is to tap on the section. You notice where it says um, last backup never, right? That is because we haven't done any backup ever on this device. So in order to do this backup, go ahead and tap that section and it will create your backup for you. So wait for it. Now it has created the backup. If you notice, it says last backup that the last backup was created now so which means um we have already created the backup just now now this is where it saved the backup that it created you notice where it says backup folder that is exactly where it saved the backup that it created so it's going to be on storage emulator zero signal and then backup so all you need to do just ignore all of those ones and then look for signal folder and then the backup folder also now let's back out so come over to the file explorer that you have. But for my case, I'm going to make use of my file because I already have this installed on my device. So I'm going to click on my file. Usually it brings you here when you click on your file. So the next thing you do is to click on the internal storage. Go ahead and scroll right down to signal section. Go ahead and 
okay this is signal click on the signal and then you notice it says backup right click on the backup now you can notice the time um the current time on our device is 1509 and the current time of this backup is 1508 which means it um saved our backup one minute ago just like it did on our signal app so in order to save this backup to an external or to an online backup app all you need to do is to click and hold on it for for it to give you more option you notice where it says share on the bottom area go ahead and click on share and for some case you might just click on the three dotted icon to um tap the share now you notice where it says add to drop boss i'm going to go ahead and add this to drop boss so you can create a folder to put it on the drop boss or you can just drop it right here by clicking on the add so let me just go ahead and click on add to add it to my drop boss so it's going to take a while to upload depending on how um how large the file is um if you notice right here nothing is uploading that is because it currently uploading so um and also another way you can back this up is just click and hold on it and click on share and now i can put this on my email the reason why i can put it on my email is because the file size is just 21 megabyte but if you have the file size up to 100 megabyte or 200 megabyte upward um it will be best to put it on your google drive or on your uh, dropbox so i'm going to put this on my email because it will be accepted on the email because it's still very small so i'm going to say I'm going to type the email of the person that I want to send it to. So I'm going to send this to my other email address. And for the subject, I'm going to say signal app. I'm going to put new backup here. Oh, up. So new and then forward. So once I have this forwarded, all I just need to do is to come to my Gmail, open my Gmail and I can come to my sent boss I'm already on the send boss usually it should bring me here so just click on the send boss you can notice the email i just sent now is um 15 um 11 11 15 so click on that and that is my new um backup so i can always download this or i can just put it on my google drive if i want to so that is all how to back up your um signal application or signal chat app on your device and also online so on the next video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to restore this backup on your device. So make sure you stay subscribed, like the video and stay safe for my next video. Peace.